It is with a profound sense of responsibility that I come before you today. The modern state university has sprung from a demand on the part of the people themselves. The people demand that knowledge shall not be the concern of scholars alone. The uplifting of the whole people shall be its final goal. This should never be forgotten. Uplifting is foundationally a poetic word. The first recorded use of the word in English from the mid-16th century referred to spiritual uplifting, the lifting of the human heart. The meaning of the whole people for me is both the global and the personal. Each person who comes to the university has the opportunity to, to be made more whole. C'est une interpellation à se préoccuper de toute la personne, de la personne entière, de toute la communauté, de la communauté entière et de placer les connaissances et l'évolution de la connaissance et du savoir au service du mieux-être de la société. To me means uplifting people who are marginalized in society, people who don't have the same privileges and, that we have here in North America. Uh, so as far as I'm concerned, it means uplifting people in Africa, in, in Asia, people who are considered to be marginal in their own societies and in our society. It means the First Nations, Métis and Inuit, as well as all the other people of Alberta, the nation and the world. It means bringing education to everyone, bringing knowledge to everyone. Using that knowledge to, to understand that you have the capacity to make change in the world. C'est inclusif, ça élève et ça nous inspire. What we're looking for is for everybody to lend a hand to those in need and to make an effort to change somebody's life um, for the good in areas that we can. It's basically thinking about the bigger picture instead of just yourself. I grew up in a small town who's just doing what's right and kind of coming back to the golden rule. Um, it's not putting profits ahead of everything else. This is about providing uh, that steady improvement of the human condition. It, it means working in deep collaboration with wider communities to really take our society forward. You know, the more you know, the, <laughs> the more it will benefit everyone globally. Well, think of climate change, think of any of the really tough, complex problems we're facing. No one sector of society, no one body of knowledge is going to be able to save us. We actually need to get down in the dirt together and really uh, figure out what to do. Every individual person is basically like a thread supporting a larger tapestry. To me, it means basically bringing political freedom, political expression um, to different communities around the world. I think it means equality and justice. And I really think we can live that, show that, teach that, research that, disseminate it. And that's the gift we have to give to the world. We need to identify uh, those areas of research that will help to make life better for people around the globe. And that doesn't just mean standard of living, it means thinking towards our long-term sustainability and contributing to that. If we say that we want to uplift the whole people, then we better match what we say the rhetoric with actually doing something about it. They haven't forgotten.